Hello again VR fans! Last week saw the surprise 1.40 update for Drunken Bar Fight by the Monkey, which adds a new police station location as well as more toys to attack nearby innocent bystanders with in this classic VR physics based party game. But does it add much more value to this fun but ultimately shallow game? Let's jump in and find out. And as always, stick around until the end of the video to get my opinions on whether or not this game still deserves your attention five years after its original release on PC. Well, apparently I have to hang myself in. Um, how well do you think that's going to go? Hmm. <laughs> I can't be charged. I am the law. Wow. Okay. Awesome. <laughs> wow. Stop doing that. It's weird. Stop it. Oh, okay, that's fun. Boss dog. Pretty sure I've seen him before. I've arrested my own wife. I know people. Dangerous. Yeah, I'm a dangerous person. Can't tell. Look, I'm wearing a helmet. Backflips. Okay. That was an accident. That wasn't. What's that dog? Catch it! I'm sorry. Someone needs a little motivation. I'm gonna knock you back hey. faster than a pint of the hell? I don't that's have nice. enough money to post bail because I spent it all on a muzzle and saw on Etsy. Oh, that's too much information. Oh! No parents? Some actual pieces of powers made me hit my separation date. Get that cop's gun. Boof. Ah. Whoops. Oh. 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 Evidence room. How's this evidence? It's all about the inches with you. Oh. Where am I? There I am. Get up, you idiot. I don't even know how to use a gun. The only one I ever shot exploded in my hand. I'm sorry, but did you just say I'm not? File that is a bit weird. I Oops. All my Why would any femoid want to breed with you? The oh, wow. Ouch. Okay. Guess well, that was evidence of something. Wasn't me. The voices made me do it. I'm just jealous that my dad gets it every night and I don't. That's it. Good. I can't believe they finally arrested me for. Oh, sorry about that. You ready to get crumpled by the rubble? I'm gonna throw you down the 12 steps. Well, this I'm gonna throw you the shot. Get the hell off. Get out of here. Oh no, attack the furnace. This place is just a temple of toxic masculinity. You know who we're messing with, huh? Hi -ya, hi -ya, hi -ya. Get out of here. Get out of here, Stacy. You dare question Jenny McCarthy? You will join us. I'm gonna knock you back. What? Don't eyeball screw me, asshole. 
Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Didn't I tell you to stop it? Stop it! I'll tell you right now. I feel bad for the first doctor not to lay my hands on when I get back to my parents' house. Whoa! Gotta go 217 in progress! Um. Oh! That was nice! We got a. Uh, whoops! I wanted to beat up a superhero! This is the best chance you're gonna get! Sorry! I don't know about you, but I love shooting at cops and getting arrested. Violent. Leave me alone. Oh, wow. Okay. Furry culture is not the pre propaganda. Yeah, well, it's a. That's a debate for another day, really, isn't it, bud? Oh, you drink too. Oh. Of this guy's neck. Sometimes I think my life would be easier if I was a cat. Oh, I'm sorry. Did you not like Event Horizon? Uh, oh, oh. I mean, it wasn't great. Scream, piggy! Scream! I'm not a pig. Sure. Ah. Me, eh? I do have one thing in common with vaccines. We both caught injury and when death. group? Wow. <laughs> Sorry about that. Guess we got a second angel molest. What? Hey, stop being a jerk. Let me have one. When Drunken Bar Fight featured on Node at the end of 2016, I was in awe of what VR was capable of, and what was potentially possible in the future of the platform. It was really mind blowing to watch my favourite YouTubers of the time literally beating NPCs up in over the top comedic settings. But that was over 5 years ago, and a lot has changed since those early days of VR, even if Drunken Bar Fight remains almost entirely the same game. It's still fun in bursts and remains a great way to introduce new players to virtual reality, especially younger players. My youngest son, who's currently 13 years old, can spend a solid hour giggling with delight as he punches in-game NPCs in the crotch with a guitar, but even he gets bored of it eventually. On top of this, the game suffers from some really long load times, which break up the action significantly. And these have never got any shorter despite a couple of pretty decent content updates in the last couple of years. And yes, it is awesome that the developers are still supporting the game years down the line, but it's seriously showing its age, with many games better in it in the same or similar genres, even on the equally aged PSVR hardware. So, with this new content, would I suggest you buy Drunken Bar Fight in 2021? Eh, not really. It's cathartic and does allow you to release some pent up aggression on a bunch of hapless computer characters. And it even has a multiplayer mode. But there's so little game for the price, which is usually around $20 on the PlayStation Network. And I guarantee you'll be done with it in an afternoon. My suggestion would be to pick up Swords with VR instead. It's roughly the same price, has a ton more content, and recently released its own hand to hand combat patch only a few months ago. Thanks for watching, and if you're interested in more PSVR fun, then why not hit the like and subscribe buttons, and leave a comment like these two certified VR legends, and hopefully I'll catch you all in the next video. Bye!